So what if Buggy got abstracted like the characters in the amazing digital circus? Okay. I said that so the funny thumbnail on YouTube would make sense, but we are talking about black masses and clowns, so it kind of makes sense. Anyway, what if, at some point, if Moria does join Cross Guild at some point, I don't know if he will, but if he does, what if there comes a time in which he uses the sort of shadow absorption technique on Buggy, like the Lola gang, the Rolling Pirates, use the captured shadows on Luffy so he could become nightmare luffy i think that would be really cool and really interesting especially if buggy was implanted with the shadow of mihawk however i think buggy could cheat the rules of the exhaustion associated with a normal person absorbing shadows because buggy has the power of the chop chop fruit which means he can split his body up so seeing as how the rules of the chop chop fruit are kind of weird because they all can fly except for the feet so maybe just maybe each portion could be treated like a separate individual. Therefore, you could put a shadow into each portion of Buggy so that way he could easily reach or maybe even go further beyond the 100 shadow limit that Luffy was capable of doing back in the Thriller Bark arc. Also, what seems to determine the amount of shadows a living person can absorb is a strong spirit or maybe a pain and or exhaustion tolerance, which Bucky has. Because in Marine 4, he survived some pretty traumatic events, like being frozen by Kuzan and then being thawed out by Akainu and not seem to be bothered by either, even though he was immobilized by ice. Even still, though, he wasn't really frightened that these things happened to him which is interesting he was more so annoyed by the admirals as opposed to being afraid of them which yeah that's just an interesting thing to think about but moving on which means that you could get a very very powerful nightmare clown in this scenario literally becoming a killer clown from outer space in a way but I think that would be a very interesting way to display how Moria now values the uh, power of teamwork and being a part of a living crew again. And I think that'd be really cool for Buggy and really cool for the Chop Chop fruit to see what you can actually do with the weird rules associated with that fruit. But with that being said, that's all I have for you today. Give me your thoughts and tell your friends about Paula P. Woodson.